God bless you, beautiful people, prophetic VIP people. God bless you. Happy Sunday. There is a video that uh, I posted on my YouTube channel. And uh, I sent it to a group that I belong to. So somebody requested that because I didn't talk, I didn't say anything concerning the, the video. I just uh, arranged it and pasted it there. You know, but somebody requested that I should talk about it. I mean, to say my own opinion, to, to speak, because I didn't say anything in that video. And I really appreciate that. Thank you very much, because that is why we are here. So I always say things you want us to talk about, your opinion is very important. My opinion is important. So everybody's opinion is different. So what I want to talk about is about Apostle uh, Cassie denying Christ. So it might sound, sound there somehow to every one of us because we think that he's supposed to know better. So that is his own opinion that I will play the video. But before I play the video, I want us to study the word of God because as a Christian, that is where our, our faith lies. By the Holy Spirit that is helping us. Through the Holy Spirit that is helping us. So we rely on the word of God. The Bible said, I hear the word of God in me, in my heart, so that I will not sin against him. It's through the Holy Spirit, every one of us, we need to uh, uh, stand we need to, uh, with our faith. Because the Bible said, if your faith, if you faint in the day of our adversaries, your faith is small. So adversaries can come in any form. Temptation can come in any form, not only uh, 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 what they call they point you I don't want to say it here and I will play the video so that you understand where I'm going to because YouTube have their po policy not only they point you something on your head to say uh, deny Christ or I blow you off your head he said he will repent he said we deny Christ then he will repent after that who won't die I don't want die according to him I will play the video as I said you know the Bible says he that love is life it will lose it. That's what Jesus Christ said. And the apostle of those days, and maybe there are some these days, that they did not love their life unto death. See what Ephesians said. Uh, Philippians, sorry. I will read the book of Philippians for us to know what he's talking about. <clears throat> not just to study the word of God, not, not just to know the word of God. Is to, uh, 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 what they call it, is to, is to put it in practice, all right? Is to put it in practice, to be the doer. That is the word, the be doer of, of it, okay? So he said, uh, uh, Philippians 1, 21. Philippians chapter 1, 21. He said, for to me to live, for to, for to me to live is Christ, and to die is gain, okay? Everybody wants to make heaven. Nobody wants to die. Everybody wants to make heaven. Nobody wants to go early. Fine. He must, he, he's talking about if the Arab come to the house, da 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 da, they say deny Jesus, he, he will deny Jesus, and uh, later he will, he, he will ask for forgiveness. Let, later might not be there. Don't you think so? There was, maybe later will not be there. Maybe the time is denying Christ, he thinks that he wants to leave. I don't know who he's going to be living for. You know, they must still do what they want to do, the people that came to attack him. And that time, there's no time for repentance. There's no time for him to repent. There's no time for anybody to repent. If that person is in that situation, the prayer we're supposed to pray that God will strengthen our faith. God is strengthening our heart. As a Christian, we say we are soldiers of Christ. Not only, as I said before, not only this, uh, uh, maybe pointing something to your person attacking, it might be sin. It might be sin, it might be, it might be uh, fornication, it might be adultery. See what happened to Joseph. It, it, it's the state of your mind, it's, the state, it's your faith. The Bible says, work at your salvation, not our salvation. This thing that I'm saying, the uh, same now, it doesn't only uh, uh, partake to him, uh, Apostle Cassie, it partake all of us. In any area, you all might be that. Everybody all might be different. 
Joseph O was different. He was facing Potiphar's wife as temptation. That is the point for him to deny Christ. Say, mm, it doesn't really matter. Even though I fear God, it uh, doesn't matter. We, you know, no. If you are standing, stand well so that we know where you are. You are. Somebody was saying that people say uh, 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 this word is not balanced. He said it depends where you stand. <clears throat> and I picked that. It depends where you stand. It will not balance if you don't stand well. In other words, if you are a Christian, what I'm saying, please stay as a Christian. Christ is there. You have assured us. <clears throat> Excuse me. This cold time is just disturbing my truth. Sorry about that. This, this life is not easy on its own. But with Christ, it's easy. He has assured us that. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, let's see what happened to them. In the book of Daniel, Daniel chapter 3, then let me read it from verse 13. Daniel chapter 3, verse 13. Please, brethren, be strong in heart. Don't let anybody deceive you. We are saying it now because he, 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 he said, I don't know, he's apostle. He may be just a, a person that just said that just coming is different. But he says apostle and he, he, he stands to open his mouth to say that kind of thing to his audience. There are many things that pastors are going through. They will not let the members know. Because for you letting that, that member know, you are breaking them. You are breaking them. A bishop said, I don't want to mention his name. He said, what I'm going through, if I cannot handle it, why will I tell my wife? If I'm crying, why will I tell my wife that see what I'm going through? That is, you want me to uh, destroy her faith or destroy her? He said, as a man, I need to know how to communicate it with her, to her. Amen. I'm just trying to rush because I don't want this video to long. People don't watch video that is long this time. They forget that I, I, I'm giving out, out a message there so that everything will be balanced because I like things that is balanced, not going one side and all that. Amen. So Daniel chapter 3, I will see how fast I, 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 I will do it. Daniel chapter 3, verse 13. He said, then uh, Nebuchadnezzar, in his rage and furious commanding to bring Shadrach, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, then they brought this man before the king. We all know the story. About the king said, bow down to my gods, worship my image, da, 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 da. They said, no, they will not bow down. So they went to go and tell the, the, the king. Now the king is angry. Just imagine when king, they are angry. The king of the, this earth, just imagine. So when they are angry, they, they, will brought, they brought somebody, against, they are angry against someone. And that person, is, he, he came to his palace. In fact, the face alone, we make you say, ooh, ooh, I didn't say so again. Isn't it? But these people still stand. Mesha, Shegrak, and Abednego still stand. He threw them to the furnace of fire. He, they don't care. They say, see what they said here, that, that it triggered every one of us. It baffled us. It said in verse 17, I'm just trying to rush, okay? In verse 17, it said, okay, see what, let me read the, uh, uh, this one first. Uh, verse uh, 15, last, uh, 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 last one, verse 15, last one. It said, and who is that God? Nebuchadnezzar is talking. He's talking to the Jewish people. Uh, uh, Mesha, Shegrak, and Abednego. He said, who is that God that shall deliver you? out of my hands. Well, Sistine said, Shedra, Meshach, and Abednego answered and said to the king, to the king, O Nebuchadnezzar, we are not careful to answer thee in this matter. You have to stand your ground as a Christian. You see what the, the, the book of Philippians said, for me to live is Christ, to die is gain. All right? So, if you want to live on this earth and we are living for him, now the person you are living for, the almighty God you, you, you are living for, I am living for, at the end of the day, we are denying, okay, where are we going to? Praise God. 17 said, if it be so, our God whom we serve is able to deliver us from the burning furnace and he, shall, he will deliver us out of thy hands, O king. 18. He said, but if not, in other words, if God decides, say, mm -mm, 
Make the just burn. Make the go like that. You see? He said, it's if if uh, he said, but if not, be it known unto thee, O king, that we will not serve thy gods, nor worship the golden image which thou hast set up. Do you get that? So it is your faith, it is my faith, not our faith, no. Your faith, what you are studying, the closer, the, the encounter you have with Christ, that will make you to stand in the face of crisis. How can you just open your mouth and say that kind of a thing? How can we in our closet, oh, he say his own as well, but others that we don't know, every one of us, all our secrets, let us remember that God is watching. My brethren, I'm here to encourage you. No matter what the Bible says, what can separate us from the love of Christ? Nothing, no tribulation, no, no gunshot, no this, no, no, no death, no mountain, nothing can separate us from the love of Christ. So be strong. Temptation will come. This thing I, I, I want to say now, I will put it in another video. Concern me what happened. I, 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 I was taking care of my children. My husband wasn't around. I don't have what they call one euro. I was living in Spain then. But somebody came in my presence. I know the, the person came from where he was doing dubious work. He came in my present, withdraw 2,000 euro. He was telling the other one, ah, if you come with me, if you see what is going on there, da, 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 da. That was temptation for me to say, ah, until me will go to home. I know that place is it, 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 it's not where I'm supposed to go. It's not where I should go. It's not where I should be. No, I, I didn't take that ad advice. I, I, it, it, didn't, it didn't trigger me. I just go back to my closet. I start praying to God. I say, God, please help me, Lord. And God did. But it takes patience. It takes patience because some people, they just say that, ah, God is too slow. Let me just find a fast way. The end, the Bible said, is destruction thereof. So please, my people, no matter temptation you are facing, Eh? Apostle Cassie has said his own. What is your own? Is it adultery? Is it fornication? Is it lying? Is it unforgiveness? Whatsoever. Just try. That's why we are, we are, the Bible says we should examine ourselves if we are still in faith. In other words, if you are not still in faith, you still have time. I still have time to make it work because the dead cannot praise God. The dead cannot serve God. Amen. So there's no repentance in grave. Listen to it. If I rub a book off of my head, say the one shoot me, man, I deny Jesus. I go deny her. As I come up for there, I go say, Father, forgive me. Now me one die. No, no, now, no, now me one die. That is the knowledge we are talking about. In the face of death, don't deny Jesus. Yeah. If Andrew had come to the house now and tell you, deny God or you die, then you will not say, oh, uh, if I deny God now, if you look at deny God, though, then you will not say, ah, please, so uh, I, I, I know God is better I die. Is that not foolishness? So, denying Christ is foolishness. He says, is that not foolishness? Said you want to die because of Christ. And see what the book of uh, uh, Philippians 1.21 said. So it's a foolishness for you to, to say, I want to die because of Christ. That's what he's saying. He said, uh, he, he, will, uh, he will deny Christ there. Then later he will say, Lord, forgive me. You don't even know if there's later. <laughs> Not to say some people, when they do that, thing, they will see by, let me use that word because that is the word they are using because of the Facebook. Uh, YouTube or social media. Huh? They will still buy that person. The person will still go, oh, who are you going to meet when the person buy? You see? Please, this video long, but watch it, okay? There's something I want to pick out in the book of Acts. Just that one, we close with that, all right? In the book of Acts, chapter 21. Chapter 21. Let me read this from verse 10. And as we tarry, 
there, as we tarried there many days, there came down from Judah a certain prophet named Agabus. Verse 11. And when he was come unto us, he took the ghetto of Paul, bound it around his hands and feet, and said, Thou said the Holy Ghost, so shall the Jews at Jerusalem bind the man that owned this ghetto. And all shall and and shall deliver him unto the hands of the Gentiles. And Jesus have told Paul that he will suffer. See what he will suffer, and he has sent it to the Gentiles. Now a prophet is prophesying it. So verse twelve, he said, "When we had we had these things, both we and they of the place besought him not to go up to Jerusalem." So the people now, the, Paul was not there when the prophet was doing that, tying the ghetto and prophesying. So when Paul came, the people told Paul, a prophet came, oh, see what he was saying, oh, please, my brother, Paul, don't go to Jerusalem. See what Paul said. Verse 13, then Paul answered, answered, what meaneth ye to weep and to break my heart? For I am ready not to be bound alone, uh, uh, only, not to be bound only, but also to die at Jerusalem for the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Hey! May our faith not fail us. Let me stop this video here because it will be too long. Please, my brothers and sisters, let your faith be strong. Don't let anybody de de uh, deceive you. That is why I say study the word of God yourself. Because if you trust in pastor, if you trust in this, if you trust in, trust only in God. That is where we. That is what we carry because we are not going to meet pastor. They are not going to. They are not the one that is going to judge. It is God that we judge. So it is that God you need to serve with all your heart. It doesn't matter what person say. What matter is God is pleased with you. That is what he said to Jesus. This is my beloved son in whom I'm well pleased. May God be pleased with you and I in the name of Jesus. This is Prophetic VIP TV. Share my video so that other people will see it. As we are speaking, God is using every one of us to do evangelism. And remember, he that wounded his soul is wise. God bless you. Bye-bye.